Yo guys, what is up, this Nick? We are back on Diamond Dynasty, and we've got a couple of new cards. We've got the Nelson Cruz Breakout, and we've got the Mother's Day Jose Bautista Flashback. So I have one of those packs to open up, not for Ho but for one of the items. Uh, I actually pulled... I don't even know how to look at this. Can I... I actually pulled my first diamond. Um, I pulled it out of the free pack for, like, logging on nine straight days or something like Getting those stamps, you know, at this at the at the opening screen when they have you when you sign in they have they have those like stamps i don't know how to explain it better than that but they have those stamps and i pulled my first diamond i pulled kenley jansen uh it was kind of surprising um i wasn't expecting to get a diamond i was just hoping to try to you know get some silvers beef up the squad um that was about it but i pulled kenley jansen i'll probably end up selling him because my team's not that good, so I'll probably need to sell him. But I haven't quite decided. I might uh, use him. I'm going to be trying to do the Conquest mode tonight, do grind that a little bit. Um, uh, family is out of town, uh, and it's just me at my house. So I'm going to think I'm going to make myself some like breakfast. I'm going to sit down, pull up somebody's live stream, and go ahead and just grind out Conquest mode. But we have some packs to open. We have the free ones that they gave us uh, for their servers sucking, and then I bought 10k more stubs so that I could open up 20 packs and this bases loaded May 12th pack that gives you uh, one of the items for the flat postseason flashback Jose Bautista. Uh, if I sell Kenley Jansen, I might actually go ahead and try to get this Jose Bautista. Um, I'm not entirely sure yet, but... I, I do have some interest, but we'll go ahead and open this up. So you get three cards, and then you get these kind of heart uh, Mother's Day cards, um, equipment cards, and you need 15 of them in order to get the Jose Bautista. Uh, so I have three currently. Um, I had a, actually a decent kind of stub hold up or stockpile, and I spent them on those because I wanted to see what it was all about and whatnot. And I'm not really, I don't care too much about my stubs at this point. I'm not like too into Diamond Dynasty. I'm, I'm going to get into it this summer more, uh, but I'm not into it that much. I'm more into my franchises and whatnot. But we have 20 packs to open here. Uh, 10 of these are the free ones that they gave us, and 10 of them are uh, the, the, uh, the 10 that I bought with stubs. Uh, so uh, the silver guaranteed that I got, I believe it was Gary Sanchez. Uh, I didn't think you guys... Well, I actually wasn't going to record this, and I was like, well, I'm opening up packs, so why not record it? Uh, so we have some packs here. I'm hoping just to maybe pull a gold or something. I don't know. I'm not really looking for anything special. Um, that Kenley Jansen pretty much made my made my day, so whatever I get out of these packs is just kind of gravy. Um, so I'm not, I don't, I don't, don't have a too big a concern on whether or not I pull anything good. Uh, but that's not bad, Patrick Corbin. Actually has a nice boosted overall. Wellington Castillo is holding at an 80. I think that Gary Sanchez I have is better. And then I have a Wilson Ramos. I think he's 84 overall. Um, I pulled him out of the pack with Kenley Jansen. So, uh, no, wait. I don't know where I got that Wilson Ramos. I got a Wilson Ramos from somewhere. I didn't get it out of the Kenley Jansen pack. I don't remember where I got it from. But I do have a Wilson Ramos, so I don't actually need that. Uh, so I don't need anything in this pack. Uh, I'm hoping that uh, if I can pull a bunch of stuff, I can start doing maybe a collection or two or something. Get something done. Um, because there, I, need, I need to do the Conquest mode, because I need to get those cards that you get from Conquest. Because opening packs is not the way to go, but for 10 bucks, I thought, I, you know what, I can... I can open these up, maybe I can get lucky and pull something, and if not, I get some cards to maybe, you know, sell or do some sets or whatever. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with them, but there's Mark Trumbo, but his overall is down to a 79, so he probably doesn't make my team. Looking for, you know, those silver players that get a boost. We had a roster update today. Um, I think that's what changed a lot of the overall, so I'm going to see a lot of ones that I was like, oh, because Thames is, like, down to a 79 now. He did Homer two nights ago, I think. I think he homered two nights ago, and then he had a really good night the day after, so I'd expect his overall pro Okay, two Miguel Mont... Wow, we pulled the two Cubs catchers together, and I just pulled a Miguel Montero, so... 
I would expect Thames' overall to go back up a little bit, but who knows? I'm not entirely sure. But nothing too far, too interesting out of these packs so far. We haven't pulled anything. The servers are still, like, really slow. This takes forever to open up packs. Like, it's really annoying. Okay, another Patrick. I'm just pulling, like, dupes on dupes. Like, pa two Patrick Corbins. We got two Miguel Monteros, and that's just the ones that I have noticed. I probably have more dupes than that that I've pulled in seven packs. And Patrick Corbin's not bad, though, so I'm not really that upset. In 86, he'll probably make my rotation at an 86. Uh, Nick Markakis, nothing really interesting out of that pack. Like, this is like Madden 12 slow. Like, Madden Ultimate Team 12, these packs were about this slow to open. Now we're used to, like, clicking on a pack and it opens, like, immediately. Uh, looks like we got a silver. Tyler Thornburg pulling a lot of Cubs. There's Addison Russell. Majestic Green Stadium. All right, about halfway through these standard packs. Nothing to write home about yet. I would like, you know, just just something interesting. You know, go along with my Kenley James. Give me something I can pull that I would be interested in. Like, fully, I'm keeping that card no matter what. Every time I, I pull Michael Waka all the time, and when I pull him... That stupid blue background always, like, throws me off, because I'm used to seeing, like, the crowd in the background, you know, that blur of the crowd, or, like, the mound, or the outfield, or something like that. You see something like that, and the Michael Walker card has, like, that blue background, and it always throws me off. Uh, we got a silver, Steven Vogt, another catcher, not really gonna help me. Bonifacio. Been playing in the majors a little bit of recent. Ah, uh, it doesn't. Oh, we got a sell. Ooh, Haley Ramirez, up to an 88. That actually is pretty nice. I'm happy about that. That he might actually make my team, so I'm happy about pulling Hanley there, up from an 81 to an 88. Yeah, so I think pretty much, for, unless some of the cards on my bench went up too, I'm pretty sure he's gonna make the team. Whenever I auto-generate that lineup so I can get the best players in, it always takes Bogarts out, and I don't know why, because he's the best shortstop I have. It always wants to put Trevor Story in, and I don't really get why. Oh, got a silver. Okay, Carter Caps. Uh, Scooter Gannett. Nothing too interesting out of that peg. Healy Ramirez was good. Not necessarily worth the ten bucks I spent to get these pegs, but it's not a. It wasn't a bad pull. Uh, let's see. Got nothing out of there. Adrian Gonzalez. No, eh, not much out of that. Dodgers playing in cores tonight should be interesting. After they. They had, like, a horrible performance last night, but they scored some runs late. They actually, like, made it interesting at the end of the game. Uh, got another Scooter Gannett. Okay, nothing there. wonder what I do. I, I should look into more about the stadiums and, like, the, and the bats and whatnot, because I haven't really looked into that. I need to do some more research on Diamond Dynasty and figure out exactly... Because, like, if I sit down and I play my team in NBA, and I sit down and I play Mutt, I, I know what I'm doing. Like, I, I've played those modes enough. I haven't played Diamond Dynasty enough. I've played very little. That's why I want to sit down tonight and play some uh, of the Conquest mode. Nothing in that pack. Nothing over a 76 in that pack. That was an awful pack. I think JT Riddle just got called back up to the majors by the Marlins a couple days ago. I don't know if it was for a spot. It was for a spot start or if he actually stayed up. Uh, but I know he got called up a couple days ago. He got called up earlier in the season and played mediocre all right. And then he got sent back down and then they called him back up again. Oh, we got two silvers, but nothing too interesting. And Adam Wainwright and Michael Fulmer. kind of crazy that I get excited about silvers in this game. 
three more packs to go. I guess we're just looking for another silver. Maybe I'll bring a couple of Conquest videos, but I don't know how much of that is worth recording. Michael Bourne, Dan Straley, nothing too interesting there. Hank Conger. Alright, two more to go. Takes like a minute to open. Takes like 30 seconds to open one of these packs. Alright, nothing. No, oh, we got a silver. Uh, it's Jose Peraza, who's down overall. Uh, Mitch Moreland's up to an 82, but not better than that Hanley. So he won't make the team. Uh, but maybe I'll record a couple of Conquest videos. I don't I don't know. I don't know exactly uh, how interesting that would be. Maybe I'll record one and see, see how it goes. Final pack. Can I pack anything interesting here? Uh, doesn't look like it. Nope. Got another Mitch Moreland. Uh, but nothing too interesting out of this pack, but I did get that Kenley Jansen, uh, so I'll probably be selling him, depending on what my bullpen looks like. I think I got an alright bullpen. Uh, I don't really think I need Kenley Jansen, but who knows, depending on how much he goes for. I guess, I guess let's take a look. I guess I can take a look real quick at how much he's going for. Okay, so minimum overall, I'll just go to 90. Uh, closing pitcher for the Dodgers. Dodgers, there we go. And Kenley Jansen is going for... Oh, okay, he's going for 65K. All right, uh, buy sell options. <laughs> I actually haven't sold a card in this game, so let me go ahead. Request to... To buy Kenley Jansen and okay, uh, starting at how do I how do I do this sell sell at sixty five thousand. If it starts at seventy two five, wouldn't I want to sell it for a little bit more than that? Great sell order. Can I sell it for seventy thousand? Right, is that? what I would want, 70000 If I sell it for sixty-five, how much am I going to actually get? 58000 Uh, let me sell it for 69000 Actually, can I sell it, can I do the old mutt trick? I can do the old mutt trick. 69999 it always gets, it still gets people, and I don't, I don't really get it, like, I guess it's just, like, eye shock, you're just like, oh, hey, it's that cheap, let me, it's not 70k, let me buy it, but guys, that's gonna do it, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, um, I'll try to start getting more into Diamond Dynasty and bringing stuff, but they only re release cards, like, every Friday, and with the roster updates and whatnot, so, I'm not really sure how many, like, news update videos I can bring and whatnot, but we'll see. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you all in my next video. Peace out!